Hello students, how are you? Hope you are doing well. Now the question is, an electric lamp is designed to operate at 110 volt DC and 11 ampere current. If the lamp is operated on 220 volt, 50 hertz AC source with a coil in series, then find the inductance of the coil. So the problem is based on the topic, the fundamentals of uh, the AC as well as the DC, the fundamentals of uh, the resistance and reactances. So there is an electric lamp in this particular question. There is an electric lamp and this particular lamp is designed to operate on 11 ampere current. And in the first case, 110 volt DC signal is applied across it. So when this particular signal applied across it, then the 10, 11 ampere current flows through it. So from this particular data, we can calculate the resistance of this particular lamp. So resistance is nothing but the voltage upon current. So 110 upon 11. Voltage is 110 volt and current is 11 ampere. So this comes out to be 10 ohms. So 10 ohm is the resistance of this particular bulb. Now this particular bulb or lamp is operated in series with a coil or an inductor and placed across an AC signal. Now this particular AC signal is having a having a voltage of 220 volt and a frequency of 50 hertz. Now we have to find out the inductance of this particular coil. Now in this situation, we can say that when the current passing through this particular AC circuit is 11 ampere, this current is equal to the applied voltage, the total applied voltage, RMS value of it, which is 220 volts upon the impedance Z. Now the impedance Z is given by square root of R square plus X of L square, where X of L is the inductive reactance. So we can say that 11 equals 220 upon square root of R square plus XL square. Now let us solve this particular equation. So this comes out to be 220 upon 11 is equal to square root of r square plus x of l square. Now this thing comes out to be 20. Now squaring both sides we get 400 is equal to r square plus x of l square. Now r is 10 which we have calculated earlier. So the square of 10 is 100. So 400 is equal to 100 plus x of l square. So from this we get the value of x l square as 300 or we can say that xl is square root of 300 which is equal to 10 root 3. So this is the value of the inductive reactance and now the inductive reactance the formula for the inductive reactance is omega l where omega is 2 pi f multiplied by l. x of l we have calculated as 10 root 3 this is equal to 2 pi into 50 which is the frequency in hertz of the applied signal multiplied by the inductance. So from this we get the value of inductance as 10 root 3 divided by 100 pi which is equal to square root 3 upon 10 pi Henry. So this is the value of the inductance in Henry's square root 3 upon 10 pi. So hope you understand the solution. Thank you.